Hey, what's up guys? This is Henry from Tech Daddy Videos and I'm just making another video on um, shipping products uh, merchant fulfilled. Um, shipping products merchant fulfilled. I, what I'm doing right now is I'm not sure if you can see all the stuff I have here. But um, that is going to be sent to uh, the post office and... Um, that's where I'm at. I'm on my way down to the post office right now. And uh, once I get there, uh, I'm going to show you the bins that we put them in. Uh, usually a distribution center uh, in the back. Uh, there's a whole bunch of bins that you can um, drop all your stuff off and just dump it there. And then it, it gets there to the people fairly quickly when you do that instead of dropping it uh, in the front here. So... I'm going to kind of be careful because I am driving and making a video at the same time, which you should not be doing, but hey, what the hell. I make videos in my cars all the time, right? So, um, so anyways, uh, yeah, uh, Merchant Fulfilled pretty much is when you go ahead and you get the orders uh, and then you ship the product out yourself. Uh, you don't do amazon fba fulfilled by amazon it's cheaper that way to do it this way uh, especially if you have small products the reason why i'm shipping these out here is because they have batteries in them and so uh like adult toys and stuff like that that have batteries in them that you can't um uh you can't ship out uh, through Amazon's FBA program because uh, Am Amazon will not allow it unless you uh, have special re uh, permission and you're going to have to fill out some forms uh, just to get that ship uh, because it's considered uh, hazardous material. So um, the reason, you know, it's hazardous because they can explode and, and what have you. So, you know... Um, Amazon doesn't want their warehouses going up in flames, so uh, they go out there and they uh, um, will have you ship it yourself. So, sorry for the video, guys. I'm over here driving, like I said, so I'm just holding it up myself. I don't have it on the stand or anything, but uh, uh, anyways, uh, yeah, so a lot of this I will ship out myself and uh, get that taken care of and, and uh, it's like I said it's cheaper um, when you do do it that way um, it is it is a lot cheaper and so um, I prefer this method anyway just because um, um, like I said it's quicker and you know here's the thing is I for example I got two orders that came in within a half an hour and so <laughs> uh, it came in about a half an hour I'm just laughing because there's a there's a um, here let me show you you can see that there is a post office guy here that's doing his deliveries might as well stop him and say hey I got some packages for you but uh, they don't do that so but um, yeah so uh, Merchant Fulfilled, uh, you can actually get the product out quicker uh, by doing that, by going out there and just um, doing it yourself. And, you know, uh, a lot of times what I'll do is I put my inserts in there, you know. So if, um, you know, I'm selling on Amazon, so I'm, what I'm going to do is I'm going to, I what I do is I put the inserts right here in the envelopes themselves. And so the inserts basically will say, hey, thank you for your purchase. Uh, I appreciate your business. And, um, uh, you know, please feel free to leave me a positive review. You know, uh, you don't want to ask them for a five star or what have you. Just a positive review. And once you do that, uh, they open up, they get what they get. And then they see that little insert in there. And it's a very professional looking insert. You don't want to put a piece of paper in there saying, oh, leave me a review, whatever. Um, and that way, you actually can get really good reviews that way. I do that instead of um, uh, emailing people because emailing is personal. And so if I go out there and, um, you know, I don't want to bother them with emails. I don't want to sit there and go... Um, 
oh yeah leave me an event email or leave me a review and uh oh did you get your product it was a great no you know just put an insert in your um in your envelope and saying you know thank you for your business that's all you have to do and so um you're killing kind of two birds with one stone when you do do that so um again what i'm gonna do is uh, i'm gonna show you guys i'm gonna have to be really secretive about it because you're not supposed to be filming inside um, um, the post office I think I'm not sure who knows you know they have all these rules and regulations and you know I don't know if you can or if you cannot but um, anyways um, I'm gonna go ahead and just um, uh, take you in there show you exactly the bins I'm just gonna drop it and uh, they do give you um, sometimes they'll give you a tray if you have a lot of if you lot have a lot of stuff um, you know to dump off they'll give you a tray and uh, you know there you go so um, so I got a tray here as you can see um, there you go United States Postal Service and you just take that to you know just take that with you you can take it home and or wherever your business and then uh, just go ahead and drop them off but on the weekends there are tons of people that um, that do this they do merchant fulfilled because merchant fulfilled is like I said it's 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 simple you can ship it out yourself if you don't have time then do the Amazon FBA program and Amazon will charge you for uh, the service but you're kind of um, getting away with all those other extra fees when you do merchant fulfilled too um so like i said i'm just doing this because i do i i actually do both i do uh fulfilled by amazon 90 percent of my stuff is fulfilled by amazon just because i have a lot of stuff in there and so um but as far as uh, some of the other stuff that is hazardous material and stuff uh, well that's where this comes in I send this off and I don't have to worry about it they don't know what's in there and you know you're you're not keeping it in the Amazon warehouse and there you go so okay guys we are here um, and uh, I'm gonna go ahead and park and we're gonna get ready and kind of show you um, the process okay so let me go ahead and and park and uh, go from there so all right looks like there's one guy here now um, yep looks like there's one guy here now so I'll let him go so I'll let him go so there won't be anybody in there and I don't want to be filming anybody uh, as I'm um, showing you guys how to do this okay so I'll wait for him to get out oh there's a supervisor there too so but um, all right turn this car off and go from there so I'm gonna kind of point the camera towards where I'm walking you're not going to be able to see um, me talking and then I'll I'll talk to you guys when I get back to my car okay so all right so why don't we go ahead and do that get started i'll go around to the other side this guy's leaving and we'll go from there all right here we go So these are the bins that are back here, basically. And so we're looking for like the first class and find out. Looks like this is the first class here. So just dump it in. That's it. Pretty much. And as you can see, there's my car. And get 
this. I'll put this in the back here. guys well hey i mean that's pretty much it you know what i'm not even gonna uh start this up here well, um that's pretty much it guys for this particular video i just wanted to show you the the process the steps very easy to do um i do have more training videos uh on my website at techdaddyvideos.com and so feel free if you guys want more training videos to take a look at my website take a look at all the new videos i have out there and um, uh, we will see you guys on the next video okay this is just a very simple video on merchant fulfilled all right guys we'll talk to you later you guys have a good one see ya bye